The number of new COVID cases fell below 10,000 today, but health officials warned against expecting a declining trend. They also said efforts are continuing for the purchase of Bontech doses for toddlers. Janice Lowe reports. Health officials have disclosed COVID outbreaks in two hospitals. A female patient who contracted the virus on Tuesday at the Hong Kong Buddhist Hospital remains critically ill at Queen Elizabeth Hospital. Two more patients were found to be infected. A 91-year-old man at the Medicine and Geriatrics Ward of Princess Margaret Hospital tested positive yesterday. The hospital identified three more COVID patients after contact tracing. At the Zhangxiu Team Home for the Elderly, seven residents and three staff were infected in the past three days. All employees at the home have to conduct nucleic exit tests for three consecutive days, while 26 residents have to be evacuated for isolation. The city locked 9,901 new cases, of which 187 were imported. Although there were about 700 fewer infections than yesterday, health officials expect the rising trend to continue. They again urged parents to take their toddlers for Sinovac jabs, as BioNTech shots for the youngest age group are unavailable yet. I understand our relevant colleagues are still uh, liaising with the pharmaceutical company to try to buy the um, baby version of the BioNTech. I understand it's in progress, although we do not have an exact date of delivery. The virus claimed eight more lives. Another 350 COVID patients were admitted to hospital, taking the current tally to 2,667 with 13 in intensive care. Janice Lowe, HKIBC.